Hey guys, it's Clint, and uh, the Culture War just stepped it up another level in Comics Gates. So you'll, you'll may remember that Peter Semetti of Alterna Comics was swatted, oh, two weeks ago, I think. And now, just today, it looks like Edwin Boyette was just swatted as well. And so he posted this little video. He's going to talk a little bit more about it. And so this video of mine is going to be pretty short, but I did want to get the word out there uh, that this is happening. So I wanted to get out what he so said. So an interesting morning. Someone just trying to uh, swat my wife and I. <laughs> thankfully, thankfully, one of my coworkers is a police. Now, I, I, I do have to point out that getting swatted is uh, would be an incredibly stressful situation. Uh, Edwin Boyette is a, a good-natured person, I guess, so he's going to be smiling about it, and, uh, you know, that's okay. Uh, having said that, uh, because he can take it in stride, that doesn't mean that it's a joke. This swatting is not a joke. It is beyond, far beyond a joke. It can be a very life-threatening situation. So just wanted to make sure that I emphasize the gravity of what happened. Chaplain, I got a church with a lot of Honolulu police. They're very professional. And once I explained to them what was happening and who I work with, everything came down real fast just walk down and talk to the building management and the security and stuff and, and thank them you know because it's kind of stressful for everybody if you get angry on my behalf though if you get angry on my behalf i, I do have to say this before he has his call to you know for uh for a reason <laughs> uh, and that is yeah swatting affects a lot more people you whoever's doing the swatting you think it might uh, just affect the this particular personality that you don't like that's in comic skate uh the truth is it affects quite a lot of people it affects the police that are headed over there uh you know preparing for the the worst situation they can imagine or whatever nonsense you've been telling them on the phone and then they also have a huge impact on the family can you imagine uh, his wife and, and what she's going through. Can you imagine, uh, like he was saying, the security guards in the building that, uh, you know, that really shook their day up. Uh, this is, it, it affects a lot of people. So even if you have a problem with a particular person in Comicsgate, realize that swatting is not a good way. Go ahead and call people names on Twitter, block people, you know, wh whatever, make videos, all that kind of stuff. The moment you get uh, armed police involved, uh, really, this is how someone gets killed. This has happened before. And while you might have a problem with Ed Edwin Boyette, and he's the person that you want to be swatted or in harm's way, the truth is there are a lot of other people, innocent people, that they have, might not even know about Comicsgate whatsoever. And you're putting them in the crosshairs as well because things can go wrong. And that it's already happened. It has already happened before. Please don't say anything that would embarrass you. Communicate a threat, right? Well, whatever happened to me, yeah, it, it is. It's a little frustrating, but but don't do anything or say anything on my behalf that would negatively impact you, right? Okay, and I gotta say this. Uh, it, it's also okay. So an overreaction to swatting. Listen, swatting makes Kongsgate look better. It makes anti comics gate look very foolish so the the wrong kind of response would be to say hey we're going to swat you back or something something like that something aggressive the right thing to do is to make this public make it be known and uh you know if, if anti comics gate is willing to defend this kind of stuff then that then that's on them and the police are going to investigate accordingly so thanks for watching. I'd love to hear your thoughts on this. I, I'm glad to see that Edwin seems to be doing okay, and I want to hear more as this situation evolves. Thank you very much. Don't forget to like, subscribe, ring the bell. Sign up for uh, my email list for Downcast because that comic book is going to be awesome, and I will talk to you next time.